I actually grew up on a farm, so there was no artistic background. It doesn't run in the family. My father was in the army. I was doing art A-level, and the question was to make a sculpture entitled The Embrace. Growing up on the farm, I'd often seen lambs lying, and they lied to keep their heads warm. And it's sort of like an embrace. Ended up selling it to one of the parents for 50 pounds. It was brilliant, and somebody had given me some money for something that I'd made. I ended up traveling a bit in Africa, and, you know, just had all this inspiration. I love traveling to go and look at wildlife. If I can sculpt in front of my subject, I will. Sometimes I'm in a field with a bull or I'm in a stable with a horse. I've sculpted albatross on the back of a boat, the Arabian gazelle in the desert. Photographing an animal in its natural habitat is very important to me to get an understanding of what the animal looks like. Very soft, aren't they? Not just as a physical form, but also what's going on up here. You're not sure about me, are you? Being a sculptor, it's everything. It's my life. My hobbies, my passion, it's fun. I'm, I'm really lucky to be making a living out of something which I'm really passionate about and I, and I love.